swear doing these in my car is not intentional every single time. Yeah. So I thought I would do this now because there is still sunlight out. I haven't run yet. But that's happening in just a few minutes here. Just wanted to do like a little brief update of, you know, this week in running. Running has been going very, very well this week. Um, no crying on the treadmill, so we got that going for us, which is always a plus. Uh, <laughs> no, um, no real struggles to speak of. Eventually I'm going to go back and talk about what it was like those first few weeks for me and working up to where I am now. Getting pretty close to bumping up the amount that I run per time that I run. And I'm gonna be honest, I don't feel like I should be bumping up the amount that I'm running, like, just yet. <laughs> I, I really don't. But that's not up to me. That's all on my trainer. Yeah. Still doing 2.5 miles. Um, and sometimes I can do it in like 30 to 32 minutes and sometimes I don't do it until like 40. It is what it is. And I honestly don't know until I get on the treadmill how much I'm going to burn and how fast I'm going to go or how slow I'm going to go. Some days I feel super motivated and I get there and I get on the treadmill and I'm just like, oh dear God, I can't do this. I can't breathe today. There's something wrong with my lungs. I'm probably dying. And then there are days that, like today, I'm going to go in and I am, I'm so tired today. <laughs> it's been an interesting day. But I'm very tired. <laughs> and um, who knows, I, I could beat my record today. That's, that's just the way that my body works. As of this morning, I am down four more pounds from where I was for my first update where, you know, it says 20 pounds down. So I'm down 24 pounds and it feels really fucking good. Like really good. <laughs> Very happy with it. Um, my pants are fitting different, which is awesome. I was telling my running coach that there are some jeans that I own that I don't have to even like unbutton <laughs> to take on and off anymore. They just, they just slide right on and off. And I know that's probably a good sign to go out and buy new pants, but I'm cheap. Like really, really cheap guys. So cheap. <laughs> so I'm going to wait a little bit longer before I go and purchase new pants. Mm -hmm. And I, I don't know, that's kind of a, an ego boost. So down 24 pounds means that I am now at 231 pounds, 231, because I am not an automated robot. <laughs> I'm watching everybody else around me, by the way. That's why I'm not looking at the camera too much because there's, there's a lot of people here, like a lot. But the really exciting thing about that, that I realized the other day, that is that that means that I'm closer to my 220s than I am my 240s. And that is <laughs> mind blowing. So excited. Really, it's not that much weight lost and I'm still, I still need to lose a lot. Like a lot. There's a lot that needs to be done to this. I was stuck at 235 for several weeks and it sounds silly saying it like that but when you're doing it every single day and you're stressed and you have things happening and weirdness is going on around you and blah um a couple of weeks can feel like a lifetime and I felt like it had been months and it was starting to get to me and I I kept reminding myself you know give yourself a little grace it's everyone gets stuck on certain numbers every so often just keep doing what you're doing keep burning the calories keep eating right keep you know being mindful of calories in versus calories out type of thing and eventually it'll change and it was starting to get to the point where I was like when the hell is this gonna change I'm so sick of waiting. You know, all the information that I've been given 
by pretty much everyone. Everyone's got an opinion on weight loss and running, but most of all my trainer. I definitely trust what he's got to say, and I knew that it was going to be fine eventually, and as much as it hasn't dropped like I thought it might, um, I'm still happy, like completely happy, and team alert. If you don't like hearing about women things, don't listen to this next part. I am currently on my period, so that in itself probably has a lot to do with weight at the moment. When it's done, I feel like there's going to be a lot less bloat weight. <laughs> I'm excited to see how things go this next coming month. I still don't know how often I'm gonna do updates, if I'm gonna do them on a schedule, if I'm gonna do them random like I've been doing. But that's it for today, guys. I have to go in and run and then go home and eat and dye my oldest son's hair. He's, tomorrow is crazy hair day and he wants to dye his hair green and red. Like half green, half red. Whatever, man, more power to ya. But I will see you in my next update.